<laughs> Can you get all my biceps in? You might need to zoom out a bit. Oh. Yours is bigger than mine, why is that? Okay, so I'm here today on a farm in Oxfordshire on a beautiful day. Uh, and, I'm here, and I'm here with Liam McLean. Uh, you're a PT and you're doing fitness on the farm. And today you're going to show me a few uh, moves that farmers can do on their own farm using bits and bobs that you find lying around most farms. So uh, yeah. let's get cracking. Let's do it. Right, Leah, so first exercise, what on earth have I got to do here? Well, this is a tyre drag. So what you're going to do is put the um, strap, just a simple strap, wrapped around a trailer tyre, yep. put it around your waist. Okay. It's really good for cardio, respiratory fitness. It's going to get your lungs really working hard. You're going to feel it in your legs. You're right. You're basically going to run as fast as you can to the end of this mud track and back again. Just run now. With, just with run. this around my waist, right, we're off. You might just hold it with your hands. Don't pull with your hands. It's all down in the legs. Right, okay. Right, here we go then. I'm off. And oh, it's heavy. It's heavy. Crikey. Let's right. Go. All the way to the end, come on. Oh my god. Good, big strides. Well done. <laughs> oh. And back, well oh done. Oh my god. <sighs> that right. gets your lungs going nicely. Oh, it uh, gets your lungs going nicely. That's good. So, this is good for. This is cardio respiratory, so it's cardio resistance. Okay. Anything um, that's cardio based, if you add resistance like weight or a, a hill or if you sprint, you're going to get your heart and lungs working really hard. It's going to build your lung capacity and your general fitness. So it's, um, it's a great short burst exercise. Certainly fill it in the lungs. Right, Good. next one. Next. Okay, exercise number two. Uh, what have we got to do here then, Leah? So you're going to get in, squat down, nice straight back, right. grab the handles and right. squeeze your glutes together. Use your thighs to just lift up. Keep yeah. your arms straight, shoulders back, chest high, yeah. and you're gonna walk. Just walk, okay. And when you get I'm to off. a certain point, I'm gonna stop you. You're gonna squat and drop it. Right. And then you're gonna flip the tire back to me. They're quite hefty, aren't they, these things? Quite heavy. That's yeah. about 50 kilos. Have I gone far enough yet? Good, about there, yeah. stop, squat down, yeah. lovely. Turn around, you squat and thrust forward. Flat. Flip it down, exactly. Yeah. Jeffrey, other way. Oh, this is Jeffrey, by the way. Jeffrey, you're right in the Oh, way. he's impeding my progress. Come on. <sighs> Good. Am I there? Is That'll that do. It? Well That'll done. Do. Well done. Next one. Next one. On to the fence post. Okay, right, so sun is out for our third exercise, Leah. What am I doing here? So this is a fence post slammer. So a lot of farmers hopefully will have them lying around the farm. Definitely. And this is just a post that we've slammed into the ground. Cool. So this is going to be a really good shoulder and arm exercise. Uh -huh. I want you, yeah, holding it roughly there. Soften right. the knees slightly, yep. tip that pelvis back and have a nice strong core. And you're just going to move your arms up and down, lifting that weight nice about and about slow that. and controlled. Yes. A little bit higher. Good. I normally get pe people doing it for about 30 seconds, maybe a minute. We'll just see. I like to do things to fail. So you do it as, for as long as you can until you physically can't do any more. I'm used to failing. <laughs> so you're feeling it in your abs as well, because your abs should be taking yeah, some of the bit. strain. Good, and you should feel all of your abs start to I definitely engage. feel it in my arms now. Good. Well done. One more. <laughs> okay. Good, and down. Well, well done. Well, the sun is shining. Let's, Let's move on, on to the next one. Right then, Leah. Exercise number four, yep. what's going on? Got some logs here. We're going to do a bit of a combo. We're going to do lower body and upper body. Okay. So pick up your log, yeah. squat down. Oh, right. Yours is bigger than mine. Why is that? Um, it's better, better than me. Just a little bit more experience. <laughs> okay, yeah. I like that experience. Yours yeah. Still heavy. Okay. All right, what we're going to do is squat while holding this weight behind okay. our shoulders. Uh -huh. So keep it straight back as you sit. We'll do a couple. And yep. as you come up, I want you to press. Yep. Excellent. Okay, oh, yeah, okay. I'm, still, I'm still going. Can you keep going? Yeah, right, go. Good. 45 seconds worth. <sighs> Love. Excellent. <sighs> and press. Stop. Great. Great work. Boom. So, full body there. Yeah. You've got the legs and the shoulders and arms worked out. How are you feeling? Uh, yeah, not too bad. Warm, for Warm. sure. Right. Warming up. Next one. Next one. Okay, so next exercise. What have I got to do here then? So this is a plyometric exercise. Plyometrics are basically anything that makes you jump around. 
and this is just a box jump but we're using instead of a box we're using a massive tire okay so you're going to literally go from sort of a squat position yep. boost yourself up to jump on yep excellent, and jump down <laughs> and not fall off and not fall off yep. we're going to do this for 30 seconds you're yep. going to keep jumping up and down very simple very draining so great i look forward to that <laughs> and go I'm feeling my legs already good <laughs> 10 seconds no. gone is that it? Yeah, that's all. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Good. And stop. Excellent. Good. Great, so that's all on your legs. All on your legs, but you're going to really feel that in the heart and lungs as well. And it just shreds, really does. I feel it. Good. Right. <laughs> Let's do another one. Right, Leah, so now we've got some more tyres. Yeah, these are car tyres. Today we're going to do slams because they're really satisfying and they're a really good full body workout. So. You get some momentum by swinging it through your legs and then using your abs and arms to bring it up and then you slam it down. Bring it above the head and slam down. So you're working lower body, core, arms, everything. I'm yes. going to time you now, 45 seconds. Quite so for long. keep going. So really use the stomach muscles to get it up. And final one. Excellent. Well done. Yeah, now I feel that here. In here. Brilliant. Brilliant. Right, final one then. Final one. Let's do it. Right then, Leah, final exercise. Um, we're playing with rocks. What we are we are. doing here? We're going to work on some core stability today. Okay. So, can you pick up a rock? Yep, okay. Uh, right, Ollie, maybe a little bit heavier. Right, okay. Maybe, maybe this one. That big one, yeah. I can do that, no well problem. Done. All right. Right, okay. Okay, so what, we what doing? we're going to do is stand on one leg. I want you to grip the floor with your toes. And yeah. You squeeze your glute together and <laughs> focus your And pelvis. fall on you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right like that. So you want your pelvis to be nice and neutral so that you're a nice straight pole and feel nice and stable. We're then going to raise these rocks up to about chest level yeah. and back down. And do this five times. So keep breathing. Just keep breathing. Now you're going to raise it all the way above the head. Good. And you're going to dip down and do some tricep dips. Right. Keep your elbows together. You don't want them splaying out the side. You want them coming towards each other as much as you can. Yep. So you should be feeling this in your abs and your other core muscles. Dip I feel it, my, uh, feel it in my arms. Yeah. Your arms will definitely get a good workout. Okay. And then lower it all the way down. Ooh. Right. And then we're going to swap legs. Great. Okay. Let's do it then. You know, the rocks we're using, they're not equally weighted. No, it's not like being in a gym, all, is it? Uh, sort of roughly hewn, which yeah. means your grip's going to be a lot more natural. And you're yeah. going to work that much harder just to keep a hold of it. Great. Wow. Good, good work. workout. High five. Really good. Cheers. Excellent work today.